you guys. Today I'm going to share with you my $20 Aldi haul. This haul is going to hopefully get me through the entire week of meal prepping, which is very vital this week because I am in rehearsals for my musical. So a lot of these things I don't normally buy, but I'm getting so I can meal prep and not be tempted to go bring in like Starbucks or Panera Bread or the sugary drinks to rehearsal. So without any further ado, let's get into the haul. The first thing I have here is like the generic version of LaCroix. You can have these like either over ice or just refrigerated. This is something I don't normally buy, but because again, I'm gonna be in rehearsals from like six to 10, four nights a week, I wanna have something that'll keep me hydrated, but I don't wanna feel like I'm just drinking plain water. So grapefruit, Belle, Belle V. sure. The next items I have are going into a crock pot dish that I looked up. I will link it down below in the description box. It's like a cheesy chicken tetrazzini type dish, which needed a jar of marinara sauce, some cream cheese to get that creamy texture. There's an assortment of Italian spices over there, pasta. And I won't pull them out because it's the very bottom, but I have a big package of chicken tenderloin. Can I grab it? For YouTube, I will grab it. Chicken tenderloin. So the chicken, the pasta, the sauce, the cream cheese, and the spices go in my crock pot for six to eight hours. And then there is dinner for five nights, which is great because some of these nights I will go straight from the office to the gym to rehearsal and I will literally be that crazy lady that has her lunch prepared in a bag on top of her dinner prepared, carrying it around with her to the office. But I'm trying really, really hard not to eat fast food. Uh, topic for another day, I typically gain weight during rehearsals because you get out late and you're hungry and the only thing open that's fast and convenient is like McDonald's or Wendy's. And I'm going to try to get through this entire run from now until mid to late September without fast food runs. Next in my bag are frozen blueberries. I have a whole bunch of frozen bananas from when they went on sale. Frozen blueberries with a quarter cup of plain non-fat Greek yogurt with a little bit of banana. There's an entire recipe I have for my morning smoothie. I'll either do a video on it or I'll share it down in the description. Let me know in the comments if you wanna see my morning smoothie. It's literally a quarter cup of OJ, three quarters of a cup of water, half a cup of yogurt, and then assorted berries. I try not to put too much orange juice because the fruit already has a lot of sugar and the orange juice just adds more. Next, I'll be making a lot of spinach salads, but I like to have feta on the spinach, I like to have walnuts, and then I like to have mixed dry berries. These are awesome. I like these a lot more than raisins. And these are dried cranberries, cherries, and blueberries. Something I did miss for the crock pot recipe, I need to chop one onion. So going into that Italian dish. Uh, if you follow me on Instagram, it'll be listed down below. I will either put in my stories or in a post how this crock pot recipe turned out. And again, if you do want to try it, I will have it linked below. I've never tried it before. I just, I want to make something that will last me the entire week that I can have prepped and done today, which is Sunday. My impulse purchase of this run, an avocado. I like to have avocados because I can either have half with like a spoon and just eat it as a snack or I can even put a little bit of this in my morning smoothies or on my salad. I hadn't planned or budgeted to have an avocado, but I had the extra space in my budget when I checked out and I said, okay, for a dollar, I'll go grab an avocado. My treat for the week is going to be these chips, tortilla chips and queso. Normally, I will not measure these out and eat as much as I want, but because this is like my treat or splurge of the week, I'm going to measure out, what is this, 10 to 12 chips to uh, two tablespoons. I know it sounds super lame to measure out your food, but when you have costumes to fit into and you just want to stay on budget, and the last thing I got on this haul are these dry roasted unsalted peanuts. I am trying to make something new each week that I haven't in my kitchen. Last week I made vegetable stir fry, sweet potato mash, and hummus. This week I looked up how easy it is to make peanut butter and I didn't buy any peanut butter in this haul because I'm told to put a few things in my food processor and let it run for a few minutes and it makes homemade peanut butter. 
My goal this week is to try to make my first loaf of bread and my first jar of peanut butter. I'm not gonna make a video on that because there's a big chance it could go all wrong, but we're gonna try. But anyway, all those things together equaled me $19.64. I paid with a 20 and got 36 cents back. Very exciting stuff. But anyway, that is my Aldi haul this week. I hope you guys liked it. In the future, if I have more time, I'd like to meal prep and show you guys that process. But as I do have rehearsal in less than two hours, I wanna get this home get everything set up for dinner so I can go to rehearsal, come home, and meal prep. If you guys like these videos, let me know by giving me a thumbs up and let me know down in the comments if you know of any good recipes that are quick and make a lot of food really fast. I'd be very happy to see what you guys suggest. Just leave them down below in the comments. And if you're new to this channel, click the subscribe button down there as well. It'll update you anytime I upload a new video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you again tomorrow. An old gentleman just asked me why I parked so far away in the parking lot. I told him it's because I wanted to be healthy and get my steps in. I should have told him it's because I don't like people watching me film my hauls in my car. That's normal. People take me from number three.